Well, in the last hour, we learned a teacher accused of having an inappropriate relationship with two students was relieved of duty. Holland Middle School teacher Destiny Hillman was charged in the fall, but was indicted by a grand jury. She's alleged to have had relationships with a 13 and 14 year old girl. ABC 13's Micah Hatfield joins us live with the details you'll only see here on 13. Micah. Hey, good evening, guys. Charging documents show text messages between the teacher and the students. In one of the conversations between a teacher and one of those female students, they told one another, I love you, the teacher using the word forever. When we get to middle school age, because you don't really know if, if what they're doing is appropriate, but you are you are hoping that the teacher is, is taking responsibility to maintain those boundaries. Two students, 13 and 14, tell HISD police they had a relationship with Holland Middle School teacher Destiny Hillsman last year. The 25 year old is charged with a count of indecency with a child and improper relationship with a student stemming from those allegations. Both female students saying they shared a kiss with the teacher, one claiming she touched her breast according to charging documents. It's even more so that she's going to be a trusted adult to help them understand their bodies and what's going the changes that they're going through because she went through them. She went through them the exact changes that they're going through. And so um, so there she even has more access. These were two separate relationships. Charging documents detail the teacher taking one of them to the mall and to the movies, even buying her a ring so they can have matching ones. Both girls say they went to the Holland Middle School teacher's home. So the grooming process is just that. It's a process. It's not an event. So it can it can begin far before or, or far prior to the abuse starting, but it can also continue throughout the abuse um, and even following the end of the abuse uh, to maintain the silence. Hillsman told police during an interview, according to charging documents, that she believed one of the students, quote, was her person. She went on to say that she made a mistake but was not a bad person. The investigation happening in August, HISD says that's when they relieved her of duty at the school. The TEA lists Hillsman as being under investigation. While that happens, she does still have her teaching certificate. Her next court date is May 10th. We reached out to her attorney for comment and are waiting to hear back. At HISD headquarters, Micah Hatfield to ABC 13 Eyewitness News.